like missing me as much as I'm missing you right now. Cause I, I can't deal. Like <laughs> it's too much. It's too much. first vet appointment i'm super excited um yeah like my boyfriend brought him the last time so this is my turn to bring him hey pookie boo say hey to the peoples say hey to the people boo boo yeah but we're going to the vet now um getting them all checked out i did forget the freaking stool sample but at the same time my boyfriend forgot her last time. Yeah. First time parents. First time dog parents. What do they use that for anyway? I mean, let me know. Let me know. But my baby is not feeling this ride. Um, I do live in Georgia, so there's a lot of freaking... A lot of freaking um bumps and stuff that he has to go through. And he does have a seat cover... Um, but my boyfriend has it right now because, like I said, he was the last one to bring him to the pit. So we rocking like that, but I just didn't want him to scratch up my leather seats because, baby, who about to buy a new car? Not me. After buying this one, no, not me. <laughs> not me. Hey, man, you okay? It's okay, baby. It's okay, man. Me, so cute. Like, I cannot deal. Made it. So, the vet was in between surgeries. So, I had to leave him. I'm kind of sad. Oops, sorry, car. Sorry. Sorry, bookie. Anywho. I'm kind of sad that I had to leave. Girl, shut up. I'm kind of sad that I had to leave him. Like, now I see what the moms, um, you know, with children first going to school and stuff like that indoor. Um, yeah, because I'm like super, super, super just lighting his ass. Like, I can, yeah, but now I see what like moms that, um, or, you know, dropping their children off for a daycare or whatever, whatever experience. Y'all don't mind my nails. They are. But, um, yeah, now I see what they experience because I'm in here sad. Like, who my baby at? Who my baby gonna eat? Um, is he okay? Let me call. Like, and the tech just took, he didn't look too comfortable with her, um, if you know what I mean. She was giving him snacks and stuff and he enjoyed it, of course, but yeah, I'm just kind of worried for my mans. But they're gonna call when the doctor is out of surgery so we can um, ensure that my baby is all good. So I have a few questions for them about him. Um, Cause his skin has been like super dry lately and then his appetite is a little off, but I feel like it's just him getting acclimated to the environment, to the new environment, to um, the new temperatures because the temperatures have been like all time low like 13 degrees and stuff out here in atlanta so he ain't feeling that like baby ain't feeling that and i don't blame him truly i don't so yeah i'll let y'all know what the vet ends up saying this video is supposed to be going a whole different direction like i was trying to get content like interacting with the vet and all this and that but if my baby is not um being seen by the vet immediately because the vet's in between surgeries it is what it is like i'd rather them save another dog's life hold hold my baby nitro down and i can go get him a little later but not too late because i got a, i got something to go to it's my uncle's birthday and we got a little cookout you know us new Orleans folks love a little cookout i wonder if he's in there like missing me as much as i'm missing him right now because i really want my nitro baby my nitro man but if he's not missing me, then that's fine. That's fine. I, I'm probably fine with that. I hope he's missing me, though, because I miss him. I'm going home to a quiet house. No barking dog. Like, an empty cage. Is this what the empty nesters feel like? Woo! I can't deal. Like, <laughs> it's 
just too much. It's too much. Okay, so I'm back here to get on. The vet said he's done. <laughs> Say, I give it for the bit. So now we are all done at the vet. Papa Bear, Papa Bear is playing with Nitro. Hold on, he's like trying to talk to me while I'm trying to record. Um, there's a stray dog in my neighborhood and the dog honestly looked like it's on his last whim, like the dog but to die and it knocked over the trash can at my house. So he's asking what's going on with the trash sorry babe you gotta pick that up he gonna have to pick it up sorry well he just took nitro inside um so yeah nitro boy is done for the day he had uh his second round of shots i'm super excited because now my baby is just you know getting better and getting healthier um they did go ahead and say that he had a skin infection which was why he had those dry patches like behind his ears so they ended up giving us some um, antibiotics to give him which i knew uh and it was probably because he had an allergic reaction to the collar before this baby him daddy right there okay so yeah thank y'all for coming and watching this video um yeah watching me and my nitro man go do our ditty go take care of him and have his self-care day um yeah he's been perfectly fine since the vet no worries uh the vet did say just watch out for like throwing up and um a loss of appetite anything strange just watch out for it because it could be like an allergic reaction to the medicine which i don't think he'll have um, but yeah, the vet is super happy and in love with our baby boy. And I'm so blessed to have him. My Nitro man. Y'all continue to um, like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Man, let's go.